Good morning. Today is Monday, February 22nd, 2021. And welcome to another wonderful day of learning at E Rivers Elementary School. Please stand as we say our Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, boys and girls, we have a quote for the day, and it is by um, Duke Ellington. And the quote says, life has two rules. Number one, never quit. Number two, always remember rule number one. And so boys and girls, as we pause for our moment of mindfulness, I want you to think today about how you are not going to quit, whether it is something difficult that you are engaging in, or maybe it's, you know, something academic that you're struggling or trying to really work hard on. How can we promise ourselves that we will never quit? Let's think about that during our moment of mindfulness. All right, thank you. And so boys and girls, we have um, just something special. What Black history means to e -Rivers. Hi, I'm Miss Moy, fourth grade DLI teacher. I'd like to share with you why Black History Month is important to me. Those who have no record of what their forebears have accomplished lose the inspiration which comes from the teaching of biography and history. Carter G. Woodson. Black History Month began as Negro History Week in 1926. The second week of February was chosen to coincide with the birthdays of Abraham Lincoln and Frederick Douglass began as a way of remembering important people and events in the history of the African diaspora, and as a way to recognize and honor the contributions of African Americans to US history. It's not meant to be divisive or exclusive, but to ensure that we honor those who have made contributions to history, to US history, but have been left out of our history books. Thank you, Ms. Moy. Now we have Ms. Dickerson. Hi, E Rivers. I think it's important to celebrate Black History Month and Black History all year round because it is everyone's history. And we want to be balanced, open minded, and knowledgeable learners. And to do that, we need to learn about the past and we need to make the future a better place for everyone. Bye. I love that. Thank you, Miss Moy and Miss Dickerson for sharing. Boys and girls, have a great day of learning. I can't wait to see you in your classrooms and your community gatherings or just around the building. Um, thank you for joining me for the morning announcements. Have a marvelous 